This morning we're getting uh, a briefing about how uh, people like MSF and the farmers in this area want to expand, grow their industry, employ more people and produce more for the Wide Bay region. And that's why it's important that we strike the right balance with fetch management laws and that's why it's important that last Thursday's decision stays in place. There are hopes to expand the sugar industry to um, employ more people. Uh, if we can expand the amount of land actually under cultivation, we'll see more jobs created, not just on the farms themselves, but in the support industries, in the manufacturing industries, in the fertiliser industries and in the service industries. So there is a real relationship and by closing down farms, by stopping people being able to properly manage their properties, we would have seen jobs go. Um, now we can see the real opportunity that Queensland can offer and the Wide Bay Burnett area can offer in terms of delivering more jobs because we've got sensible laws that balance protection of the reef together with the farmers' rights to develop their land sustainably into the future. And I guess the good thing about what we're seeing today is how um, we're seeing best practice management occurring on cane farms. We're seeing people reduce their fertiliser load, use less water, um, use better uh, equipment, if you like, to get higher yields, and that means more profitability, more profitability, more investment back into the industry, more jobs being created.